Hi everybody. These are your video directions for today's work and I want to just go over a few things with you to make sure you know how to do all your assignments today. If you're watching this video it's probably because you did not get a chance to get on our Zoom or maybe you had some different, different questions and you're not sure how to do something. So you have already gotten probably into Google Classroom, you found today's date, and you've already clicked on assignment one because that's how you got to this video. Make sure after you finish watching the video that you click on the words of view assignment and mark this assignment as done so that you get credit of actually watching the video and or attending the Zoom meeting. Now, the second assignment is pretty simple as well. All I'm asking you to do is to go back and take a look at the work from Monday. I want you to make sure that all four of your circles are grayed out. Notice I have two that are not. That means that I did not turn those in. So when I click on this assignment and I go to view assignment, it's going to say missing. And if you did turn it in, you're going to see a score up here. But if you didn't turn it in, this is now the time where you need to go ahead and mark this assignment as done because you did attend the meeting or hopefully you did watch the directions so you know what you're doing. All right, so that took care of that problem. Now assignments two and three, some of you may have circles grayed out, but that could mean that you did not do it right yet. So the only way to find that out is to click on the assignment and go to view assignment. And here you're going to see a grade if it's been graded, or a comment in case there's a problem. So some of you did turn in work, but you don't have a grade. And the reason for that is you need to read your comment. That's probably because you gave me the wrong screenshot, or your screenshot did not show me enough to be able for me to tell where you put your folder. So please read the directions and fix any mistakes you may have. If this was a problem, I would hit unsubmit unsubmit again and I would go ahead and just hit the X on this one to get rid of it and then I would go take my screenshot that I need to take and go ahead and click on add and create to add my new screenshot. I would turn that back in so that I can get my assignment graded. Once you have done that for all of these assignments especially two and three because these two were the ones I had the most problems with Number four, we're just supposed to let me know how far you got in your keyboarding lessons. So if you forgot to report that, again, go to view assignment. Make sure you add your comment and tell me how far you got with these lessons over here. And then mark that assignment as done. You want to make sure that all four circles are grayed out for Monday. And then you can come back up to your Friday list in assignment number two, where it says you should check to see how you did with Monday's assignments you would click on view assignment and mark that assignment as done. Now assignment three is actually getting in and reviewing those vocabulary words that we looked at on Monday on file management. If you have forgotten, there is a link and I'll put it on here, it's not showing up right now, but there is a link that I will put here for your PowerPoint or slideshow where you can go back and look at the terms that we looked at such as file, folder, file types, hierarchy, Google Drive, and then I want you to work on the crossword puzzle. So this crossword puzzle is in um, Google Sheets, and how this is going to work, it takes a little bit to load. You will see that the white boxes are the boxes that you're going to fill in. Over here is a word bank. These are your answer choices. So it says you're going to point to each box with a black triangle and read the crossword clue. So if I come over here, and I point to it, it should automatically pop up. Um, unfortunately, mine's still working and loading here. Um, but it should pop up and give me the clue, and I have to read it. Now, you want to read the top of the clue. Let's see if I can get it to come up here. Hang on. Maybe. Let's see. Let me try this one over here. For some reason. Not working today. Let's try it again. There it goes. So if you just point to it, it'll say three down. So that means it's the word that's going down. And it says all of your files are saved in Google. And then you want to look at your word choices. And then you would just simply click in the box and type whatever letter it is you want to put in there. So I'll, if I type a G, it types the G in there. Okay. Once you have that all done, you will then go ahead and go back to 
this assignment, go to view assignment and mark it as done. This is a way for me to see if you understand those vocabulary words. The rest of the time you're going to work on your keyboarding lessons. And the lessons we're working on are finishing up G and H, which are lessons 22 and 23. I had assigned 24, but I'm not going to worry about that anymore. Just try to get 22 and 23 done. If those are done, you're going to start some new lessons today, and those are the letters O and V. So your L finger is going to reach up to O. So right hand, ring finger, L to O. And then the V is with your um, left hand pointer finger reaching down, F to V. And those two lessons are lessons 25 and 26. Now class ends at 1025, so you want to make sure you want to make sure that you watch the clock on these lessons. Always make sure that you go ahead and click on quit and save um, to make sure that it saves any work that you didn't get all the way done with. Go ahead and hit view assignment. Mark that as done. All four of your circles then should be grayed out and you're good to go for the rest of the day. All right. Have a great weekend.